Righto. Say hello to a weird rocket here. Anyway, so today I'm going to be doing some <coughs> highly professional uh, termite control uh, procedures. Whatever. Anyway, basically I got a termite mound over there that wants to be real persistent. I keep chomping the top off of it with the lawnmower and they keep coming back, so I've got to teach them a lesson. <laughs> so I am a professional um, fuckwit, so don't try this at home. But I, for this job, all we're going to need is a hammer, an old chisel, some petrol, professional explosive. Uh, I'm not going to tell you what that is, but it's whiz bangery stuff. Um, basically, we're going to blop a termite mound. So, let's get to it. So, here we have the culprit mound. Uh, she's about not huge, but like I said, I keep lopping her off with the lawnmower, but it's getting a bit big to do that. Um, and I've had quite a bit of rain over the past week, so if there's any time to do this, it's now because the dirt on this is nice and soft because termites can make very hard dirt. But anyway, we'll get to this little. <coughs> professional procedure here so basically what we want to do is make a nice little hole in the top here to jam the explosive in so I'm gonna to get to that and then I'll show you my results okay so I've chiseled out a nice little volcano hole right down to the bottom as far as I could get with the hammer and chisel there I said because it's soft it's not too bad you can see all the fucking termites everywhere on there you can see where my place is just over there well, there's gonna be there's termites everywhere in this place but you gotta control them somehow I can't let this get fucking huge <laughs> um, so next step we want to do is fill this with petrol so just tipsy tipsy all that in there don't be shy Five hundred mils of petrol in there now. Um, and the next step we have: you can make sure to wear safety equipment while doing this. But we actually, don't do this because professionals only. These are my professional safety shoes. So we're just going to light this wick. If the wind will let me. And then we grab, jam that in there and hightail the fuck out of here. I think this is a safe distance to observe from. And now we just basically wait. There we go. Explosive went off. I don't know if it did much to the mound, but the flames will take care of that. They're pretty tough, these termite mounds. <laughs> One thing I really probably should have done and uh, jam all the dirt around the explosive so it made it a bit more of an impact. But I think that should be right. We'll let that burn off. That would have. Oh. <laughs> yeah. They're um totally dying. But anyway, I can uh, 
clean as clean as that one. That's a problem solved right there, I think. Not really, but it was a bit of fun. I'll catch this in the next video. Probably more serious video than this. <laughs> That's just a bit of fun. And it catches later. I'm pretty sure I do more damage with a chisel, to be honest. <coughs> it didn't even do that. Looks cool though.